Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Cynthia. I go by Simply Simpson here on YouTube and on my Instagram. I'm a part-time reseller and if you're interested in reselling videos, reselling hauls, bins trips, Goodwill trips, I do those kinds of videos. So consider subscribing. Um, now, oh, and flea markets because that's what I'm about to show you. So I'm going to show you my haul from the flea market. I went on um, I went on Sunday. Today's Tuesday, so I'm making the haul like a few days later. My bad. So let me show you what I got. I didn't get many things. I actually showed up towards the end. So what you call cleanup crew. So basically everybody was already kind of picking up their stuff. So they were get, giving better deals. Some people were even giving some stuff free. And I happened to grab some free stuff. So. I'm going to show you that right now. So first off, you probably, I got these cute little socks for my son, brand new. They were $2, so that was a good deal. I got this packet of medicine. Brand new. And that was at the stand that you saw me go that had the sign for a dollar. That was all medicine. Most of the medicine there was CVS brand, but they had a few like like name brand medicines. And this was one of them that was there. It was the only one I found. So this is going to be perfect for my husband and I when we get sick. And it expires until 2021 of November so that's awesome for a dollar can't go wrong with that got this cough medicine for my daughter she hates medicine but she gets a really bad cough sometimes so this is going to come in handy and again this was a dollar you can't beat that okay so this stand that I went to um I didn't get footage, but it was three items for a dollar. So I got three items for a dollar. <laughs> so got this skirt, mini skirt. And it's a Wild Fable size 16. And that, um, those prices, the three for one dollar, that lady is always there and she always has like a bunch of clothes and that's always her sale that she has. Um, she sells three items for a dollar. But you, she has like a big pile. Like she has like some tables set up and she has like just like a mountain pile of clothing and you really gotta dig because a lot of the stuff that she has not so good. But if you dig, you can find some pretty good stuff. So I found this Wild Fable, so Target brand skirt, which is cute. Um, this J. Crew plaid size four shirt, and it ties like from the shoulders. Like you're supposed to make like a little bow. Okay, I did a horrible job, but you get the idea. These pants. I'm not familiar with the brand, but I looked up. I looked it up in concert everywhere. So it's Rio by Stefan, I think Morton or something. 
And they're size 5, 100% cotton. And they're white pants, white denim pants. They're pretty cute. They're high rise. And they're clean, too, for white pants. So, got those. Other stand, um, it was, like I said, I went in late. So, people were giving out the deals. This guy told me that his clothes was 50 cents each. And I saw this shirt right away. And I grabbed it because it's Game, Game of Thrones. I have not, like fully watched that show like I probably saw like a few episodes like maybe four episodes or three episodes I don't even know but I know some people are hardcore Games of Thrones fans especially like the dragon so maybe somebody would want this well I'm pretty sure somebody would want this so this is was 50 cents and I had a dollar so I I, I told myself I gotta keep looking because I don't want the guy to have to give me change. I'd rather just give him my dollar. And the next thing that I got was this Calvin Klein size 24W. So 24 woman plus size jacket or blazer, whatever you would call this. So... I'm going to actually send this in to ThreadUp. I know ThreadUp, right? Are you still doing that? I'm still going to do it because I specific items that I purchased to send to them. And I just really don't want to have to deal with like listing them on my own and storing them and all that. So if I can send them over there and they can sell them for me, I'm still happy. Like I'm one of those persons that gets her items really really low so I'm still making a profit and also with this sending items this time will like make me like see whether it's worth it or not so I'm gonna give it a try and from there I'm gonna make my decision whether I'm gonna continue with it or not continue with it but for now I'm continuing it with it I'm continuing to send them stuff so this is going to thread up okay so I paid a dollar for for those two items that I sent you and after I paid for those I just walked around the guy had like other stuff other than clothes and I was looking around and then I was about to walk away when the guy said hey don't leave and I like turned around and looked at him and he's like I'm about to give everything for free so just grab whatever you want and then I was like oh okay so I went and um I grabbed some stuff that kind of got my attention but I was like eh, you know passed up because I just but didn't want it but for free I was like okay I'll take it and this was one of the items and this is a uh, Jessica London 22T so I don't know what that means I've never seen a T is it 22 toddler <laughs> i don't think so and it it was like new because they had well if you can see right here it had like a little baggie with the button the extra button but my daughter ripped it off because she's savage like that my three-year-old and i quickly took it away because it's that's not something she should be playing with but that's no longer on there. These items are for free, so don't judge me. I wouldn't have paid for these items, but since I got them for free, uh, I guess I thought it was a good idea to grab them. So I grabbed this empty candle. Empty candle. No, I'm not sure if this was from... Bath and Bodies or like Kohl's because I know Kohl's has like big candles like this or maybe even Target. Who knows? So, yeah. I don't know. Probably shouldn't have grabbed that. Did they got all these adorable little frames. Super cute. Got this bigger one. Look, you can see my ring light. It's got a price here. So $16 and then it was on sale for $6.99. I think that's pretty cute. Like a little flower and it's in perfect condition. No cracks or anything. I got this book. 
because my son is one and I thought maybe I'll read this and I'll learn something because I have no idea how I'm going to potty train a boy. If you guys have any suggestions, leave them below. I'd appreciate it. I grabbed this thinking, hmm, maybe this is a gem. But no, I looked it up. They sell it for like $3.99 or $4.99. So maybe I'll just sell this locally. Local, locally. And then um, it has the person's name on it. Pokemon. Got this sign. Love to all who enter. That's cute. Oh man, sorry guys about my ring light. It's making everything so glary. Oh wait, do I have it backwards? No, I don't have it backwards. So these little critters, they are so cute. Actually. Don't want to drop them. Sorry, I'm shaky because I don't want to drop them. So those are so cute. They're like miniature. And there's 18 of them. So that was free. Okay, guys. So that is everything that I got at the flea market while I was there on Sunday. I spent $6. Yes, you heard that right. $6. And I got everything that I showed you. Obviously, nothing is amazing. But there's things in there that are going to be useful for my family. there's some stuff that are going to make me some money so i'm happy with that trip um let me know what's your favorite item that i got leave me comments below because i love to interact with you guys give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends share it with your neighbor share it with your neighbor's neighbor and if you're not subscribed already consider subscribing hit the bell to get notifications for when i upload videos thank you everyone for watching Bye.